Hello everybody, welcome back to another showcasing video. I'm going to be showcasing a new item that I've gotten in the past couple of weeks and I wanted to save it for when I had a, a new light in front so you can see the item rather than relying on the side lights and I think with the ring light it looks great so yeah. We have the Quadcast by HyperX. And what this one has over my Blue Yeti Nano microphone is the ability to have a action anti-vibration shock mount, a top to mute sensor, and four polar patterns, which this one has two. And it also has a pop, a built-in pop filter, whereas this one does not. So. I should have a bit clearer sound going into the microphone and a bit more customizable options with this compared to this. So yeah, let's open it up and see what it looks like in person because holy crap, this is going to be awesome. What the hell did I do with my shit? Let's open this up. I kind of don't want to ruin the tape here. So I think I'm just going to do this. So just in case I have to take the item back, I prefer to peel the tape without having to cut it. So that way I can just lay the tape back over and then return it. But as long as you are careful with peeling the tape, you shouldn't rip the box at all. Although some people are ridiculous with ripping the tape off, especially on a PC game box. And that was unacceptable on his part. I'll show you a picture of it right here. And I'll cut the video until I can get this stinking thing off. Okay. I have this thing peeled up. There we go. And now it's off. Hallelujah. Alright. Get the over there. Okay. Alright. Open this up. And what we have first is HyperX has you covered. Well, I'll be the judge of that. <laughs> Got issues? Yeah, just contact the, them for any support that you may have. And this one is congratulations on joining the HyperX family. And it shows some HyperX products like keyboard, headphones, and a quad X quadcast microphone. So that's the black version. I have the white version because why not? I had the black microphones for years. This one is the gray one and this one is the white. So yeah. Alrighty, we have a product information type of bull crap. We have a quick start guide showcasing what each thing does. There's the four polar patterns. There's it shows what things are on the microphone. So there you go. All right, let's get this thing out. Wow. And inside the box, we have a two-year warranty thing. Wow. Some microphone. This is all plastic. Where's the actual microphone, man? Oh, my God. <laughs> I wanted to have a slow opening, but no. Apparently, it had to be stuck in there. At least it stayed upright. <laughs> Alright, here's the cable. USB providing power to the microphone. And it's USB-C, which is very nice. Whereas this is not USB-C. It is micro USB, I believe. I want to check, but I can't do that at the same time because I need this for commentary. So, I will post the text right here to let you know if this is micro or whatever but this is USB-C which is nice and it's white with braided cables so it has a proper sleeve you can't really see that I apologize but I'll, I'll take a picture of this and show it on the screen what the braided actually looks like but yeah it is a nice cable and right here we have the little mount so when you want to mount this on a a 
extension type of stand where you can have it over or on a mic stand. That's what this is for. And yeah, here's the microphone in person. This is the Hyro X. Apparently the P is silent because it's blocked by the light. Oh my god. <laughs> so yeah, there you go. Hyper X. There you go. Alright, so on the front here we have the lights on the bottom here. And what those represent? Microphone gain knob. So this actually turns. So it gains more I think it I think what the gain is, it gains more of the background sound or something like that. I'm not sure what exactly the gain is. I'll read about it in here, but apparently that's what that does down there. This is the anti vibration sock mat. In here's the pop up the uh, pop up built in pop filter right there and on the top here is the tap to mute for mute in the microphone whenever you need to whereas on this microphone the blue yeti nano you have to push this button right here on the front the green light you have to push it and it goes from green so yeah when it's red, it's muted. When it's green, it's on. You dig? Okay. And on the back here, you have the pattern knob where you can go between bi-directional, omnidirectional, cardioid, that's right, and stereo, apparently. That's new. This one has cardioid and omnidirectional patterns. This one has stereo and bi-directional included, so... Yeah, get out of the way. Stop blocking me, huh? How about that? Cardioid, I think, is the best one to use because it focuses in one direction to you, so it picks up the sound that is being directed to it. Bi-directional is on both sides, so one here, one here, that's bi-directional. Omnidirectional is all around, and stereo is actually three sides out of four. So, if I had the microphone here, it would come from here and here, but this wouldn't pick up any sound. So, huh. It doesn't even explain what the gain does. Wow, this manual is ridiculous. On the back there, you can see the USB-C port that it goes in and the headphone jack. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time for more. Later.